Welcome to Shea Today, where we dive into building science, energy efficiency, and all that goes into building a high-quality new home. Our Shea Homes models, and we're here with Darren Waschek with DR Waschek. Darren, pleasure to have you here today. Yep, happy to You're be here. You're going to be demonstrating a type of a test that we do in one of our homes? Yeah, we're going to be doing a blower door test and showing, uh, showing everybody how a blower door test works. Okay, how many tests do you perform to make sure that our homes are certified for Energy Star? Well, for Energy Star, we do a lot of testing and inspections. And so probably between 40 and 50 uh, tests and inspections all together. 40 to 50. Mini Ken, did you know that? That's, that's a lot of testing. It's a tremendous amount of testing. And when do you actually start with your first test and to get to this point where we're going to see a blower door test today? Yeah, that's a great question. We actually start uh, when the house uh, is still in frame and before insulation goes in. So we go into the house and we will verify that we have the framing correct and uh, the duct work is correct. We'll do some testing of the ducts, uh, check your windows, and then we do a come out a second time for verifying that the insulation is correct. And then the test that we're going to do today, the blower door test, comes at the very end when the house is finished uh, just to make sure that the house is tight. And we'll explain a little bit about that as we go through the, uh, the process. Gosh, that's exciting. I can't wait for us to take a look at this. So Darren's going to walk us through this process. Thanks again, Darren, and we'll be right back with you. So you can see that the door looks a little bit different here. Uh, the uh, blower door is set up and we're going to run this test. But let me give you a little bit more information about how the blower door works. Uh, the, the idea is that any air that you can take out of the house using a big fan like this uh, has to be replaced with air coming in through holes. And so the blower door allows us with the, uh, with the, the uh, digital gauge, allows us to calculate how much airflow is going through the envelope. And holes would be, as I said before, recessed can lights, uh, holes in a door or window. And one of the things that's special about builders that are doing Energy Star like Shea Homes is that the, uh, they work really hard on putting good windows in excellent doors that are sealed well and then the, the recessed light fixtures are actually airtight insulation contacts so there are actually a lot of effort goes into making sure these are high performance homes so let me take a minute and we'll, we'll, uh, we'll actually run the test and you guys can see what the digital gauge looks like and how the fan operates so the blower door when we run it what we're trying to do is actually depressurize the house we're going to suck the air out of the house and we're going to keep doing the, running the fan faster and faster until we get the house to a negative 50 pascals. And a pascal is a very small pressure. In fact, a post-it note set on your hand, it actually puts one pascal of pressure on your hand. So if you can imagine a stack of 50 post-it notes sitting on your hand, that's how small the pressure is that we use to calculate how much flow we have uh, from inside to outside. And so we'll go ahead and run the test right now. And with the test, we're going to uh, take the fan and move it up to faster and faster until we get the green side to read 50. And you can see we're getting close there. Oops, a little bit too much. And we get it reading right around 50. Doesn't have to be perfect, but pretty close. So when we get it right to 50, then we go over and we look at the, the red side and that will tell us how much leakage we have in the envelope. And right now we're reading roughly around 1200 cubic feet per minute. That's short, we call it CFM. So we'll, this test is actually uh, going to be a 1200 cubic feet per minute at 50 pascals. So now we know what the results are. What we do is we actually have a target. So for Energy Star, we predetermine how much leakage is allowed. And for most builders like Shea, who build really tight houses, uh, the target is going to be a number maybe around 1500 CFM. Uh, this house at 1200 is performing a lot better than the target. So as long as you're below that target, you're doing really well and you pass that Energy Star inspection. So this is again one of those high performance tests that we do uh, that is uh, critical to making sure that all of the things that are part of building science and how, perform, how, how houses perform uh, is all working correctly. So this house is excellent, it's ready to go and we're going to put an Energy Star label on it. Shea Today is brought to you by Shea Homes, committed to enhancing people's lives through the construction of the finest homes and communities in America. For more information, visit us at SheaHomes.com or call us at 1-866-OWN-SHEA.